Hi, I'm Tony Fleming, and this is Fleming's Ultimate Garage. Hey, everybody, thanks for joining us on today's video. You know, in the world of muscle cars, the GTO definitely stands out as one of them. But when you find a GTO that, uh, that's really correct, it's really authentic, and then adds on uh, the multi-carburation and the most powerful engine transmission combination you could get, uh, that's when you start to talk about collector cars, collectability, uh, investment grade, and things like that. And that's what we have here today. And I'm going to walk around. I'm going to show you what I'm talking about. We have some great documentation to back it up, including pictures of the restoration, car completely disassembled, pictures of every nook and cranny of the engine while it was hot tank, rebuilt, all those good things. And this thing makes some serious horsepower. It is an original 389 tri-power car, according to the Pontiac Historical Society documents. And those will be provided to you because after you see this video, you're going to have to find a way to get this into your garage uh, because I'll tell you, it is awesome. So let's just finish the video. Then you go ahead and call us and, uh, and pay for it. But until then, don't do anything. Stay with me. All right, so silver mist gray metallic paint, original factory color. Come on up here. And it is beautiful. It's a little bit over restored, this car. It's a little nicer than it was when it came out of the factory. But for me, that's the way I really like it. Wet sanded and buffed and just looks fabulous. All the chrome and stainless is new. All the headlight buckets, grill, uh, windshield surround, glass in the car. You need to see the pictures of this. Now come on up here. This is kind of uh, interesting and very rare. All right, so check out this piece right here, man. We're talking about uh, Redline radials. Now listen, it would have come stock with belted Redline tires, and we have those available as well. But I gotta tell you what, if you're gonna drive the car, this is the way to do it, because it drives so much nicer. Uh, but if you're gonna show the car nationally, then uh, you're probably gonna wanna get the uh, bias ply tires, all right? Look at this, beautifully redone set of the Hurst uh, Magnum wheels that they put together. And the Hurst wheels are a beautiful design to begin with anyway. And these ones right here are beautifully refinished and redone and just spectacular to look at, I gotta tell you. All the great little emblem call outs, beautiful paint and body finish. Just little things like, listen to that. Fabulous, the GT call outs in the rear. The nice thing about this car, it's not a post car, okay? This car is exactly the way it was built at the factory, in this color, with the vinyl top on it like it was supposed to be, okay? And let's just keep walking around. This is nice here, it's got that great Hurst call out for Hurst equipped. Exhaust, now the exhaust tips are incorrect for the car, but the car sounds so good with its exhaust, we can just change the tips if you like. But other than that, I think you'll be pretty impressed with the rest of it. All right, let's check out the trunk for a second since we're here. Okay, look at the detail in here. From the jacking instructions up here, circa early 1960s, this is a bias ply uh, tire that would have come on the car in a red line or a white wall. We're trying to keep it authentic. All done in here, new trunk pans, floor pans, painted, new mat, chrome, stainless, all that stuff, all redone. New emblems. And if we could, here's where I would like you to look. Take a peek under here. Check this out. Look at the detail there. Now this has an upgraded sway bar in the rear and the front. So the upgrades on the car are the suspension where it has uh, aluminum adjustable shocks. It has the sway bars on there and this upgraded exhaust system. Those things are all uh, easily changed if you wanted it to be back to bone stock, but they're what make the car drive so much nicer. It handles well because this car is probably one of the fastest GTOs we've ever had. So when they rebuilt the engine, they added some modern uh, touches that they learned over the last 30 or 40 years building these engines and got a lot more power out of the car. Now what we're going to do is we're going to open the hood of the car because that, my friend, is where this car separates itself from all the other GTOs that are out there. So check this out. Look how beautiful this is. Okay, so for instance, we start off with the tri-power setup three two-barrel carburetors, the way it would have rolled off the assembly line circa 1964. Uh, Keep in mind, this is a first-year GTO as well, so it makes it even more rare. There was not a lot of these built, especially like this with a four-speed, not done like that. So, uh, in little things, like come on up here for a second, little things like these uh, relays and things that are original that have been restored, okay, and the detail here. Power steering, you know, we forget to ask about those things, power steering, but it makes driving these cars so much nicer, all right? the fans detailed, the radiator is upgraded, okay? And then uh, we have the correct cap for it, but the radiator is an upgraded unit because this customer here wanted to drive his car. So if he was gonna go to a show 
and sit in traffic and idle for an hour, hour and a half. He never wanted his car to overheat, and that's why he put this big radiator in here. But you can see the detail of the suspension here. What we're going to do is take a quick peek under here so you can see how beautiful everything is right here. Look at all that. You can take these decals off or ask us to, and most people won't even notice that those sway bars, but look how thick this sway bar is. That is like Porsche 911 style thick uh, for a sway bar, it's just huge. Beautifully detailed under here. Sam did the engine detail in here, and uh, our hat's off to him. It's just one of the best ones he's ever done. Gorgeous. All right, let's take a peek inside. All right, so. Little things like the console light here. Like, check this out, this works. How nice is that? The dome light, footwell lighting, original AM radio in the car, full gauges including the factory tack with the red. Uh, you can set it to decide where you want the red line to be. That's all been re restored, okay? Awesome, four spoke wheel, the machine turn dash, new dash pad, carpet, console lid, seat covers, headliner. Even the headliner's done in silver like the outside of the car with its great pattern circa 1964 headliner pattern. You just can't really get that anymore. This is just cool style, man. This is one of those things where you roll down the road in it and you're just you. People love these things. They smile, they're just happy, and you got everything you need from the factory gauges here. It has an upgraded set in here. It's your choice. We can take those out and just leave the stock ones here or, or do something else. It's got the pedal dress up down here. It's got all the things in it. I remember where every seat release is. And uh, so how about I start it for you so you can hear what it sounds like. So in closing up the video, listen to me for a second. Here's what we're talking about. We're talking about first year 64 GTO. We're talking about tri-power. We're talking about the Hearst wheels with the red lines. We're talking about a four speed, uh, the silver mist paint. These are all the things of the way this car would have come built as, and quite honestly, when you look at it, it is a spectacular piece of machinery if it had none of those features at all. And then throw in the rally dash with the tack and gauges, the great sounding exhaust, the upgraded suspension, not to mention the frame off restoration of this car. So if you don't have some way to get this into your life, you need to call us, man. We gotta figure a way to get you some real deal happiness. This is like therapy, you get in this car, and you take another couple out to dinner in, or you take the kids for a drive or whatever, guaranteed to have an awesome, awesome time. Call us 301-816-1000. We'll tell you all about it.